Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dredo Matoro and we're here with another Grand Theft Audio V PC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content and we're gonna get straight into the video. Welcome back guys, this video is all about on how to install your Rocket Raccoon Avengers Get In Game pad. So we're going to go and install this pad guys, and this comes with the weapon too. So all you guys got to do is, okay, is make sure you download all of the requirements that it's in some of the description below. And make sure that all the requirements is the latest version. Don't forget guys, you must have add-on pads, so if you guys don't know how to install add-on pads then I do have a video tutorial inside my description below so make sure you guys do watch that video if you don't know how to install add-on pads and guys like always guys I will be leaving this mod inside my description too so you guys can download it I have already downloaded the mod so I don't need to download them so once you guys have completed with all that all you guys got to do is go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click and open file location. As you guys can see, I have already got a mod folder and I already got add-on pads already installed, so I don't need to install it. Once you guys have completed that, okay, installing all the requirements, all you guys gotta do next, okay, is that we are going to install the pad. So to install the pad, guys, all you guys got to do is open up the Rocket Raccoon Extract folder and then now we are going to install the PED. Now for the PED guys, all you guys got to do is open up your Open IV and then now go to Grand Theft Auto V Windows and then once the application opens up, just click on Edit Mode, select Yes, go to your Mods folder but guys, you must go to your mod folder, okay? Go to updates, go to time 64, go to DRC packs, and then go to add on pads, then go to drc.rpf, then go to pads.rpf, and then now all you guys gotta do is copy all this and then now paste it over here. But guys, I'm going to delete all this because I don't need this. So I'm going to remove all this. So all you guys got to do is copy all the files that is inside your extract folder. The YDD, YFT, YNT and YTD files all inside your, your file over here guys. Okay. And then that's it. Now the next thing we are going to do guys. Okay. When you go back to the website, it says down the bottom over here for your weapons to install this weapon over here you must follow the steps over here so what we need to do guys is that we need to find the patch day 8 in g folder so we need to find a patch day folder okay guys so minimize your open iv and we need to find a patch day folder to find the patch day folder you need to go to your update folder over here. Go to Time64. Go to DRC Patch. And go down and scroll right down the bottom and you'll see Patch Day. And there you go. So what we got to find guys is Patch Day HNG. And we need to find Patch Day HNG. Copy Patch Day HNG folder. Then go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, go to your mods folder, go to update, go to time 64, go to DRC packs, and then patch, and then paste your folder here guys, and then now you have completed that. Now guys, all you got to do next, okay, is go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, and minimize your folder guys. Open up your open IV again, and now all you guys got to do, Let's go back to your GTA V over here on your Open IV, and now follow these steps. Okay, guys, these steps is on the website too. See, guys, 
I just copied it, okay? So guys, we are going to follow these steps, okay? And the steps is GTAV. Uh, no, sorry. The steps is GTAV. We are already in GTAV. Then mods folder. Then update. Then time 64. Then DRC packs. Then patch day 8NG. Then DRC.RPF. And then time 64. Uh, and then models. And then CD images. And then weapons.rpf right over here. Now what we're gonna do guys, okay, is that I'm gonna minimize this, okay? Go into your weapons folder, and what you gotta do, okay, is copy the whole thing, and now paste it inside here, okay guys, okay? Just paste it inside your open IV. And then there you go, guys, and now you have fully installed the raccoon and the weapon, okay guys? So, all you guys gotta do now, next is, Exit out of your extract folder, go back to your open IV, go to GTAV, edit mode, and then now close down your open IV, guys. The next thing we are going to do, guys, okay, is that I forgot to do one thing, guys. Uh, make sure, guys, I'm very, very sorry, I forgot to do one more thing, guys, is click on your file, any file, guys, and now drag it inside your desktop I'll show you guys why you need to do that now guys all you guys got to do next okay is go back to your GTAV main folder now go to your add-on tabs editor right click and run as administrator now guys this will open up okay this application will open up now we are going to add the ped inside the folder all you guys got to do is right click on the file that you paste it on your desktop and click on rename and copy the name there you go now go to pins to the drop down menu it's a drop down menu here and now click on new pid and now the model name is the recurring paste your name over here guys and the peer type it's a male and a stream and say false now click on add ped and click on rebuild and then click on ok now all you guys gotta do next one more time is exit out of your add-on ped editor and then right click on your grand theft auto v game folder refresh your folder and then now exit out of your game folder guys and refresh your desktop and then i'll see you guys in the game and now guys we are back okay so i'm gonna go and just come up here uh you go come up here guys now guys here we go all you guys gotta do okay to open up your add-on peds menu is to press the l key and there you go guys now what we're gonna do next okay is that we're gonna go and press the, the add-on pins and now you'll see the the rocket raccoon and see guys I've got the rocket recruiting right there. Look at this, look at this man. This is pretty cool. Oh, but it's too small. Let me just, uh, yeah. It looks too small. Oh, Let me put some mods on him. Eh? Have some fun with this uh, little rocket, or this little recruit. Uh, okay. Okay, I do not want, I want, never wanted, I want, ignore. Yeah. This little raccoon. Now, this guy over here is the OG. Now, where is his weapon? Hmm. I think we need to go and find a weapon for him. So, guys, we're going to go to the shop and we're going to go and see if we can buy it from there. Oh, no, we can't. The shopkeeper's gone. So, guys, let me know in the comments if you guys if do get stuck with this mod, okay? Uh, eventually, guys, um, I cannot find a way to find the weapon. But if you guys do find a way, okay, 
then let me know in the comments okay and then now uh, that will help everybody in the community okay guys so guys i hope you guys do like this mod so guys i hope you guys do like this mod okay because i really do like it but somehow i can't find a way to bring the weapon but there should be a way guys because i already installed it properly but guys with that said okay i hope you guys do like this video if you guys do need help okay and if you guys do get stuck with this mod then please let me know and i'll be more than welcome to help you guys out don't forget guys if you guys haven't got add-on pins inside your folder then i'll be more than welcome to help you to install add-on pins guys so with that all said guys i hope you guys do like this video if you guys do then smash that like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content and tutorials and i'll see you guys in my next video thank you for watching guys peace and i'm out